very much. So taking you through our story with regard to renewable energy and GIS, as clean and renewable energy is a key pillar to sustainable development, DIWA began to envision Dubai as futuristic, sustainable city that is a global hub of clean energy and green economy. Towards that vision, DIWA is developing a sustainable infrastructure and implementing Dubai Clean Energy Strategy 2050. The goal is to achieve 75% of total power up from clean energy by the mentioned year, aiming to reach 7% of energy from renewables in a couple of years from today, incrementally reaching 25% by year 2030, and reaching the goal of 75% of 42,000 megawatts by the targeted year 2050. At the same time, a lot of another, other initiatives are taking place as well. We're seeking 16% reduction in carbon emission in the coming two years, as well as a reduction in overall consumption of water and electricity. We're seeking 30% by year 2030. Many initiatives are taking place in Dubai in support of diversifying the energy mix by promoting the use of clean and renewable energy. I would like to talk about Shams Dubai. Shams Dubai is an initiative basically built on building a distribution generation for property owners in Dubai by allowing them to install solar panels on their property rooftops for uh, electricity generation, of course, while having the property connected back to the US smart grid at which the electricity is going to be consumed by the premise itself, regardless of the nature of usage, residential or industrial or commercial, and the access electricity will be sent back to DWAS network. Ahmed is going to show you how the app works. Thank you, Minel. So let's get started with the demo. Over here, we start in this beautiful 3D view of the Emirate of Dubai. Immediately, the user is tran uh, uh, transported to the location of their account, and they could already see the solar potential of the roof by the color of it. All they have to do is click, and they're immediately transported to this 2D view focusing on the rooftop along with the panels tiled on top of it. We can already see a lot of very useful numbers. The amount of energy that would be produced, the number of uh, the dirhams that would be saved off the user's bill, the avoided carbon emissions, and what that translates to both in terms of trees grown and kilometers not driven by a regular gas car. What if the user only had a small area of the roof that is accessible? Well, they could customize that area. So quickly, they can just select the area on which they want the panels to be generated. <laughs> and the panels are immediately generated and calculated. Again, those values are recalculated, and all of the values are shown here. We're also very proud of the fact that this is the very first solar calculator application worldwide where you could turn on and off individual solar panels. And as you do so, the, panels, uh, the numbers are immediately recalculated in real time. And again, those numbers could be aggregated both annually and monthly. Finally, the user is also capable to configure things about the solar panels, both from a system perspective, determining things about the system as a whole, and things about the individual panel, such as the panel orientation and even the panel angle. Also, they could modify the row spacing and the efficiency of each individual panel. As they do so, the panels are regenerated again in real time, and the numbers are recalculated and shown. To tell us about the results, we'll go back to Manel. Interesting fact that the app got more than 23,000 hits last year. Most visitors are non-DIWA consumers, so you're welcome to try it out, even though it's not going to give you the actual bill saving in uh, dirhams. Um, another fact is that um, uh, as of December 2018, DIWA has successfully connected 1,200 solar panels for residential, commercial, and industrial buildings with total capacity of 58.9 megawatts under Shams Dubai initiative. 
Uh, also, it was found that uh, solar in OCs has increased this year, 2018, compared to the previous year by 52%, which is also recognized as a high figure. We're looking for more by next year. Shams Dubai Calculator has proven to be a source for advanced location analytics for smarter and sustainable smart grid in Dubai. Next is that today, we at Dubai Electricity Water Authority, we get an insight as futuristic digital DIWA, modernized grid of a city built on GIS. We are the first automated artificial intelligence powered renewable smart grid network when substation automation, as you can see on the screen, inspired from Sheikh Al Maktoum Solar Park, we see GIS playing a critical role in enabling the city of Dubai to go towards digital and grid twin, supporting advanced grid location-based analytics, seeking to have a greater role in having happier citizens and residents here in Dubai. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.